Oh, I think we started. Shit. <laughs> we're live? I think we're live. I think we are. No, we're not. I think we are. No, we're not. Uh, the real Mike... It looks like the real Mike Urch said the vape team is the future and the future is now. Here we go. <laughs> Mark, any feelings on that? Uh, that is a clone statement. Thank you. Wow. I'm amazed at clones. How they'll make a clone of like a $25 RDA. I think they sell it to like certain countries that don't have access to vapor products and they just mark them up to the regular price and people don't know any better. I want to fucking clone me. I would love a clone Mike Vapes. I just keep them down here 24 hours a day fucking doing videos. Put them in front of the camera and you can go up on the couch and watch Netflix. Yep. Hell yeah. Hmm. It's life, baby. We got a huge packed crowd out there tonight. Good evening, everybody. We're going to start in about two seconds. One, two, let's start. Good evening, everybody. 156. The great team. It is time for the vape team. Yes. With me, as always, the man with the master plan, our special guest, Mikey motherfucking vapes. <laughs> Good evening, Greg. Good evening. Good evening. Mark, do you want to introduce yourself? Because every time I do it, you like to step on my toes. Good evening. Good evening. Who are you? And tell us a little bit about yourself. Uh, my name is Tony Digolo. I am a homosexual porn star. And I'm stopping by to hang out with the vape team tonight. Nice. You guys know that I take my 20-minute intros. Uh, uh, I'm very sensitive about them. I like my transitions, my outros, my intros. And uh, somebody had the audacity in this live chat to say they hate the intro. Whoa. Like instant triggered, I think. Mm -hmm. So somebody throw that motherfucker out of here. No, I'm just kidding. You're entitled to your opinion. Everybody has one. I just fucking think you're wrong. But anyway, yeah, this is the vape team. And we're going to start off tonight's show by saying this is a very special show of the vape team because we've been doing this for three years. This is the thir three year anniversary tonight on the vape team. Whew. Three years flies, Mike, right? Oof. Three years, huh? How long has it been with Mark, though? Well, that's what I was going to say. Um, and okay. then, very shortly after the three year start, three years ago when we started, we actually had a special guest on. And uh, the funny thing is, he was a special guest. At, what was it, like episode 12, Mark? Ah. Uh. It's you, not like I've been on the show for two months. It doesn't even feel like that long. You used to send messages on Facebook Messenger with like telling me you were interested in me and stuff like that. And I was like, dude, I, I don't go that way. And I was like, well, you're like, but I do vape reviews too. And I was like, all right, we'll come on the show. Very true. Very, very true. Yeah. So <laughs> when Mark came on the show, it was a breath of fresh air. And, and I, I, I guess we... Do you want to talk? You know what? Let's do our buffets first, and then we'll go into a little bit of talking about the channel, yep. what's happened, and how things have changed over the years, and where we're at today. And we also want to talk to you guys, because there's a lot of people out there that have watched every single show, which is like 156 hours. That's a lot of time. So, let's That's do the buffets. More than that. Think of all the overtime. Yeah, that is true. 
Not much, though. I'm pretty punctual on that, though. Yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. I think we might extend the show uh, in this coming fourth year that we're about to start. We've been talking about it. We're thinking an extra 15 minutes for three weeks a month, and then we'll do a 15-minute show to even things up at the end of the month. And we've also been talking about a time change. Yeah, how do you guys feel about that that are watching the show tonight? Mark, how do you feel about that? Do you, starting at 9 o'clock instead of 10 o'clock. That would be awesome. That'd be super awesome. Whatever, wherever you live, like if you're on the West Coast, I guess what's that's three hours behind. So we, we have been talking about that to start a little bit earlier so people that have to get up early for work will be able to watch on the East Coast. And then we can also run the show longer because it's not almost midnight. That would be cool. I don't know. We'll read chat. And while we're reading chat, I'm going to do this. So the guy that hates the intro says, yes, nine is way better. <laughs> so Brux. Nine? Nine what? Nine, nine inch. PM. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. See, that's what I'm talking about. Somebody that can have a difference of opinion and they can also support the show with their input. Yep. So, thank you. All right, Mark, what the fuck are you vaping on? All right. Uh, Joytech Espion, like the fifth one with the drop RDA on top. The Sigeli Fuchai R7 131274 with the whatever tank on top. I got the Proton with the. No clue what the tank's called on top. Got the Aegis Legend with the something mesh sub ohm tank on top. And then the Recurve with the Invoke. And I got the Gorilla Penis, also known as the Peanut Pod System. Emergency Vape Stash. Bow, bow, bow. Some Ruthless, Tropical Thunder, Nada, Portuguese Custard, and Vaptasia. Killer Custard Lemon. Thank you. Take it away, Mr. Brian. Thank you. Brian Chronicles. So (laughs) it looks like I'm looking at chat right now. Chat is right here. And it looks like I would say most people are saying nine is good. So what do you guys, when do you want to start at nine? Next week? Well, you guys, there's not going to be a show next week, right? Then we'll start fresh because my birthday, my 40th birthday is going to be the, the following show. So uh, maybe we'll start at nine and, and begin something new. The fortieth birthday bash. I do want to make a special announcement before I continue with my buffet, and I want to put this out there, Mark. You've been with us for so many years now. You've committed so much humor. You've torn many shirts. You have gotten distracted during important moments when we had guests on. You have thrown the topic of the show into total disarray. But you, my friend, have been an awesome addition. And the the vape team wouldn't be the vape team without you. So I will tell you this. Tonight, for one night only. I'm going to be a full member. You're a junior member. Woohoo! Now, you got demoted to special guest a long time ago. So you're actually a junior member. I think on the two-year anniversary, he also got this promotion. Yep. (laughs) And I lost it the next week. Right <laughs> away. Yeah. Yep. So anyway, you're back to junior member again. Now, with all that responsibility, comes the uh, action that you're going to have to take in order to to live up to the expectations uh, that we have. There are standards that we have. Uh, are you willing to accept? I'm not sure. We got to go over the contract first. Does my pay increase? Yes. No. Uh, yes. No. <laughs> no. I don't know. It's zero. So I, I don't know how to deal with that. Uh, we just got a two dollars, and it said, "Can't wait for the recurve a uh, new drop coming tomorrow." Yep. Shout out to Gregory Turner too. He had given a donation. Gregory Turner. I don't remember what he wrote. Thanks, he Gregory Turner. It disappeared too quick. Yeah, he congratulated all of us. Thank you, Mark. I'm going to need you to focus on chat tonight and read off all of the donations. There we go. Got it. <laughs> I'm assuming there's going to be donations. Everyone's I got rent to pay. Up. I got to pay for Mark's rent. His mom go. contacted me and said that she doesn't want him living there for free, so. <laughs> that would be nice speaking of the recurve I am actually vaping on the recurve this evening and so is thousands of other people because that's all I've been seeing on Instagram you know something's hot when all you see is like the same RDA again and again and it's be- the amazing thing about the recurve is it looks good on everything I mean it really does it's just a sexy shape and it looks good on everything so I'm vaping on the recurve on the Aspire this is the Speedlink, Speedlink. 
yes, the Aspire Speed Link, and I'm also vaping it on this beautiful RGX Renegade X with the recurve on top. So there we go. And what else am I vaping on? I got this in the mail today. I don't even, this is the Vape TO something bat, the super bat. <laughs> is that the smaller one? I don't know how I feel about this. It's kind of like I, copyright it, infringement slash child the same appealing. Yeah, yeah, it's just the same thing. Yeah. What do you? I don't know. Maybe we'll talk about that a little bit tonight. Like that fine line between it's okay and it's not okay. Because mm -hmm. I think there's a lot of things that are sort of, sort of like your sexuality, Mark. You know what yep, I mean? Yep, exactly. Not that it's not okay. You can be whatever you want, but you just need to be honest with us. Anyway, what else am I vaping on? Uh, I'm, I'm vaping on Dual Aegis Legends this evening. I have on this one the Corlart Mage V2, and on this one I have the Aero Tank from Geek Vape, and I'm double hitting these to this evening. I love, love, love the mesh coil that's in this tank. It's been performing awesome. Uh, what else do I have? I have the Proton from Inikin with the Scion tank on top, Scion 2 tank, boom. There's batteries, in, by the way, there's batteries, builds, wicks, and everything's wet and everything I'm vaping on tonight. Uh, juices, I have, this came in the mail today. If you guys haven't tried this yet, let me just tell you something. The Cloud Chemist Frosty Science Strawberry is un believable Frosty Science Strawberry from the Cloud Chemist, love it. Uh, I'm also vaping on Hit That Donut Strawberry Donut this evening from HitThatJuice.com. And I'm vaping on some Custard Man Vanilla Cupcake. Custard Man Vanilla Cupcake. Here we go. And who who is this from, if they want to get it? This is from Kaizen... Uh, no. P oh, Pillar of Clouds. Pillar yep. of Clouds. So there you go. And that's it. So, Mikey Vapes. Mikey Motherfucking Vapes. MF and Vapes. Before I do my uh, yes. buffet, I did say Gregory Turner. I made a boo-boo. Sorry, Gregory Brown. My man, Gregory Brown. I don't know why I said Turner. Do we know a Gregory Turner? I think we know a Gregory we Turner, We do know right? a Gregory Turner. That's uh -huh. why I got confused. Yeah. Gregory Brown is the one I gave the donation thanking us also. Shout out to you, Gregory Brown. All righty. Buffet time. Let's dive down. I love it. I love diving down. I want to dive down on you. I'm diving down right now. Yeah. I'm not even going to breathe. Do you guys like it when I do a dive down like this? Fuck right, we do. You like it? Do you Mark, want it? Yes, but Mark's drinking out of a red plastic cup. Do you want to see it? Mmm, show it to us, baby. Okay, hold up. We are vaping on today. Oh, we have enough light? Oh, there we go. This is the Devilkin? Devilkin? From uh, Smoke. Vaping on that today. It's got the TF V12 prints on top. I'm vaping on that. I'm also vaping on Pico S with, uh, I don't know, Vato Loco tank, I think it's called. I'm not even sure. Something like that. I'm vaping on that. I am also vaping on the Proton with the Scion. Vaping on that. Vaping on the Aspire Feed Link with the, what, what's the name of this again? The Recurve RDA. <laughs> Mark, didn't you have something to do with the design of that? Yeah, actually, it's Mark's design. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Assassin oh, Suicide oh. 499 she just donated because I hope you guys continue on since I something. What'd she say? Here we go. She's, uh, basically, she's done with YouTubers. She had her channel pulled down. What? <sighs> yep, she was one of the people. Her, uh, Wendy Vapes, and uh, Foolish. I'm so sorry to hear that. Yeah. That's fucking yep, I horrible. was talking to her on Instagram about it fucked up YouTube. but uh, i know uh foolish has a new channel foolish mf and wendy vapes has a new channel wendy vapes two the number two yes uh i don't think alexandra wants to start another youtube well if she does we'll support and get the word out so yeah just know that i got some names for you too if you need help with the name name for what her new channel mark Please. <laughs> Here we Take go. it away, Mike. Go ahead, Mike. Time is yours. Mark, I'm going to mute you. Here we go. Mark's getting muted. Mm. 
Now, if my vision is telling me something, it looks like there's two coils in that, Mike. Oh, shit. How did that happen? I saw, I actually, I'm lying. I saw a picture of that earlier on Instagram. Actually, that wasn't my picture on Instagram. I got a video of this one here on YouTube. Uh, I mean, on Facebook. I'm sorry. So do us a favor. Why don't you tell us how she vapes with dual coils? So, yeah, I'm vaping on the Recurve <laughs> on the Therion. Let me unzoom. Yep, I'm vaping on this setup. And <laughs> so I am sneaky. also vaping on the gold with the brass sq liquids i'm vaping on oh actually one more i almost forgot this one here too the uh what's this called again the, the sbi infinite try this shit Put that up. <laughs> yeah maybe yeah i'm vaping on this also juices i'm vaping on custard man vanilla cupcake I'm zoomed in a little too much. Yeah, vaping on that. I'm vaping on some of this stuff here. I'm also vaping on a little bit of this right here. I am also vaping on a little bit of that. I'm also vaping on a little bit of that. A little bit of this right here. And uh, this one here, I'm running on fumes. Vaping on a little bit of that also. Uh, I have this one here on standby, just in case I run out of the other ones. Same thing with this one. And pods I'm vaping on is this one. Thank you. Good evening. Good evening. So I had a problem with my Infinix. I put it in the washing machine because it was in one of my pockets. And I salvaged the battery. It still works, but I lost the pod. Hey. It's all right. Yeah. It's all good. Anything else, Mike? You're going to... What? That was the about, buffet. Talk about the dual coil in the... Uh... Oh. Because I'm interested in hearing about it. Oh, okay. I, I, I do not recommend nobody doing this. No? Especially if you're going to put it in a mechanical mod. Mm -hmm. It's too close. I use the uh, stainless steel fuse clappings. These are uh, 2.5 millimeter, and I put them, I built them, and then I put a two millimeter rod and pulled them up so I could try and make it a two millimeter. I did that, and uh, there's clearance in there, but um, it's just, how can I explain it? The chamber is a little too small for a dual coil. You get a little bit of spit back because the coils are just, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, they're so close. Yeah. But uh, hold on, let me get out of uh, up close mode. There we go. So yeah, but it's been vaping good though. I got 90 watts, 0.1 build. I just smooth. Yeah. Is it hot? Yeah, it's a nice hot vape. Uh, the top cap, though, when you're chain vaping it, it gets hot. Mm -hmm. yeah. You hear that, Jay Hayes? Oh, I know you're out there. I saw, I saw Jay Hayes out there. It's not for dual coils. It's funny because he put a quad in his, in his, in his review. Hell yeah. So this week has been extremely busy, like with a whole bunch, like, oh, we, we just got $10. Goons Forever said, congrats on three years, guys. Just got back into vaping and loving how far it's come. Awesome, man. Welcome back. Welcome welcome back. Welcome back, Goons. Yeah, What's so up? I've been super busy, but I've been getting updates on all the different things that have been going on. Like Instagram's been having like things like check your channel, back up your channel, be careful on your channel. So it seems like. There have been a lot of channels pull, pulled for using certain things and reviewing certain things. And I'm not even going to mention the things on the show tonight because I don't want this channel to get pulled. But there's things that have been talked about and titles that have been used that I guess YouTube uh, doesn't use the three strike rule. They actually completely just eliminate your channel, erases existence, and then don't give you any way to remedy the problem. 
which for people that do this for a living, that their mortgages depend on it, um, it's frightening that they would have that much power with no recourse. What do you guys think? I don't know, that's why it's tough to rely on YouTube as like your sole income because it's like you have no job security whatsoever. So it can't really be a sole income. I mean, I know a lot of people use it for that, but it's shit like this that they just delete it one day you wake up and then bam, it's gone. It ain't shit you can do about it. You can back up your shit and make a new channel, but you're going to start all over again. You're going to start, to, all your subscribers are not going to subscribe. Look, as long as it's, uh, it's on, hold up, I got to erase a comment. There we go. As long as, uh, what do you call it? You don't use certain words in your title, you're fine. The vape, the vape channels are fine, but you got to be careful. And also, if that's the rule today, and if they can come up with that all of a sudden, after people have built their channels on those things, what's going to be the next thing? And when it happens, what what are we going to do? You know what I mean? And like, Jay Hayes, you don't have to, come on, man. <laughs> Just keep it real. Follow this guy. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> I guess for a hundred bucks, fuck. I mean, Mark will suck your prick for a hundred bucks, so you could do that. <laughs> uh, maybe three hundred, but not a hundred. Mark will let you suck his dick for a hundred. Yeah, we could do a hundred. Yeah, coming in bulls, Mark. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, so a lot of people are saying like go over to Twitch, go over to you know all the different options that are out there for sharing videos. And the problem is, is that if you the way YouTube works is there's sort of a structure as far as subscribers, views, and all that kind of stuff goes. And when you reset everything, it changes the structure and how things are done. So it would be extremely challenging for a lot of people. Yep. Yeah, it's yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't think we have to worry yet. We just got to be careful what we say and what we do on our channels. That's all. Got to keep it clean. I guess it's you know. Yep. Um. If I'm not mistaken, uh, as long as uh, you're not doing anything illegal or using words of terror in your title, you'll be fine. Yeah. The problem is, is that we use lots of different words to describe things that don't necessarily have the meaning behind them. And then it's up for them to decide if it was meant to be that or not meant to be that and they're the you know and you don't even have a say in the matter it's not like they they pause your channel and put you in front of a board and say explain yourself let's watch it or let's have a review panel it's like you're done yep donation from joe turner congrats on three years guys awesome show well done hey. thank you joe turner oh how long has joe turner been with us mike yeah right a while now uh what i want to say is well, we have to be careful but all the reviewers need to be careful is the products coming out of China. Uh, they're running out of names. There's shit. What are you going to call stuff? And I'm afraid that they might call a certain product a certain name to where the algorithm picks it up as something that's related to terror. You know what I'm saying? So we have to be careful with that, too. Yep. Oh, Brian's reading chat. Yeah, I am. I'm watching a battle between Jay Hayes and somebody. I don't know if he was saying something about, I don't know, whatever. Did we just got another donation. I'm going to, you get, oh, all right, yeah, Carlos. Let's see if I can pronounce this. Hirohoka, Carlos Hirohoka, 24.99. He said, congrats to you guys on the three years. Love all your shows. Not very active in chat, but I watch all you guys. Many more episodes to come. We love you. Thank you. We really appreciate it. Thanks. Thank you, Carlos. Mwah. Thank you, Carlitos. Papi loves you. Actually, this dual coil is vaping pretty good. <laughs> is it? <laughs> but you know what it is? I'm afraid that I don't want nobody to try and put a dual coil in here. And they're going and throwing it on a mechanical. You know what I'm saying? It's so close to shorting out. So, yeah, I don't recommend it. I just did it just to screw around. But I don't recommend it. I don't want nobody getting hurt and blaming me. Plus, I mean, the thing's designed to, to work with single coil, and it vapes so well with one coil. You don't need it. Doesn't a even need it. It doesn't need to be a dual coil. Trust yep. me. You, you'd be better off doing like a a parallel build or something like that. <laughs> Stop. You know Jay's gonna ask for all this money back. Yep. Show. Uh huh. Let me tell you something. Nothing's ever free. 
So donation uh, from Jay Hayes. Don't forget to follow this guy. He said, "Vape heads donation. Here's ten dollars because I ain't high end like Jay." <laughs> Actually, uh, vape heads has given me a Dunkin' Donuts travel mug that Amy uses every day for her water, and also some uh, ice ice coffee. So thanks a lot. Vapey Miner gave four ninety nine. He said, "Anniversary." Uh, thanks, fellas. Glad I found the channel. So glad you enjoy it. More importantly, I have to say I've enjoyed doing this show. I would say 99.9% .9 of the time, I enjoy it. Making it rain. Mark, take your top off, please. I feel guilty. I uh, need to give Jay something. I'll give him some after the show. There's hidden meaning behind this. He's trying to tell us something. A personal one-on-one -on -one time. Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> Bradley, Bradley Ryan. Uh, is that Crapper? Wait a minute. Clapper. I'm sorry. I thought it said Crapper. Uh, approaching two beans. Yes. There you go. What the what? hell? Blood Rage Engage. This is mainly for Mike because I know he's pod crazy. What pod systems would you recommend? I want refillable with really good flavor and battery life. Uh, I don't know about battery life, but I recommend the Smoke Infinix. That's refillable. I got a review on YouTube for it. That's the one I like. Yeah, you can pick one of them up on Vapor DNA for I think or Element Vape. It was nineteen ninety nine. It comes with two extra pods, and it's refillable, and the battery life's decent, and the flavor's yeah. awesome. It's an awesome pod system. Yeah, I actually bought pods too. I'm got ready for uh, UK baby. Next week we're gonna be in the UK. Yes, dude. I feel so much pressure to get ready. You know, you know that feeling before you go? Because I'm actually going to be at my office. That's an hour and 20 minutes from here on Wednesday. And I'm leaving right from my office to head to your house in Brooklyn after or in Queens. So it's like. Mm -hmm. But I'm excited as hell, man. I can't wait. Donation from Chris Rice. He says, here's five bucks because I'm just a Jay Hayes clone. Jay Hayes, another donation. Tell me you love me. I knew I was someone special all along. Do me a solid, Mark. Flick, flick the nipple of the boob on the TV. There you go. I don't well, think she... There you go. He's pinching nipples over there. I wish those were real. Mark loves hangers yours. for anybody that doesn't know that. <laughs> yes. I thought those were yours. Those were, but... Why does the screen keep going black? My screen? The feed is going black, like flickering. It's weird. Is it? Were it's you doing something just now? No. It pays electric bill. <coughs> mm -mm. Hmm. Yes, yeah, someone had just said, Patrick, why was the screen going black? I don't know. I don't know. That's. Gotta be careful, YouTube. Mm hmm. I don't know. It's, it's getting overwhelmed. No. Any, uh, anything new this week, guys? New this week. I got the uh, Coil Art Mage V2 RTA. Mm -hmm. I like it. Oh, God. Amy's trolling me again, guys. She she was going to get balloons to bring down here for the celebration, and I told her I was kind of against the balloons. And I went upstairs to tell her not to take a bath at 9 o'clock, because the, or 10 o'clock, because the show's on. And that was not a good idea, because then she posted on Facebook about me, and then I deleted her post. Oh, no. <laughs> and she just said, she said, I will pull the internet. Why would you block me? I am pissed. Well, technically, you didn't block her, did you? Oh, I didn't block her from the, sh I didn't block her from the chat. Did somebody block her from the chat? No, I didn't block her. No. I did not block her from Spring, the chat. Donation from Spring Vaping Ooga Girl Spring Lassiter. That's a mouthful. Congrats on three years, you guys are great. And Brian, I never seen a pic of your bigger BOS. Oh, she shit. was the one that won the giveaway. Remember, we did a giveaway a few weeks ago, and you tried oh, to bag of shit. She tried to up, you tried to up my BOS, and the winners were supposed to post photos of their winnings on the yeah. vape. So, Mark, I guess you won. <laughs> Thank you, Brian. There you go. Fuck this YouTube. This username is that what it is? Whatever. Twenty-five bucks from him. There you go. I like hot sauce. I'm a chicken. He says. 
<laughs> Woo. Oh, fuck this YT username, which means YouTube. Cool. Spencer Fernandez says YouTube's watching. Yep. If YouTube watches this show, that's pretty flattering. What do you use when you travel on an airplane as far as vape gear? Do you guys like to carry a lot of batteries with you or do you like to just use like internal battery devices? How do you handle that? What do you mean by... Uh... Well, you're traveling to the UK this week, so you have to go through customs. You got to go through security, Mike. How do you handle that? Is it easy? How do you do it? Somebody asked in chat. Well, I put my batteries uh, inside cases. My mods inside. Everything's in my carry-on. Basically, you know, nothing inside my uh, check-in luggage. Everything on carry-on. Make sure your batteries are out of the mod. Yeah, make sure they can see them. So, when, like, if you use like a case for all your stuff, have it visible when you open it and leave it on the tray, so that when it goes through the scanner, they can see everything clearly and they know what it is. It, Jay Hayes gave another fifty dollars. Go ahead, keep uh, keep topping me. Hashtag high end. Hashtag wet wires. Uh, Sean Kirkwood, five dollars. Congrats, guys. Can't wait for the next three years. Sorry. Uh, DM. Uh, DM said the drop kept me from quitting vaping. Thanks, fellas. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great advertisement for the drop. <laughs> so basically, uh, what uh, what I suggest is have like a separate case or something, and keep all your vape gear inside that case. So this way, when you're going through a security check, you could pull that all your vape gear that's all in one case and let it run through separately. So this way, it's and open up the case so this way they could see you're not hiding anything you know you'd be fine if you have money buy one of those coil master bags those things are like the best best thing ever to use yep. you have straps in there to hold your mods and your batteries and shit best case ever for travel yep. hit that juice.com has them nice I'm gonna nice miss. I'm going to minimize the screen. By the way, for all of you guys that have been watching for three years, if there's anybody new, all the old school uh, family members that are out there watching, if you have any specific questions that you have for us, put it in caps and we'll see if we can get to them. Uh, David Pearson said $1.99. Mark hasn't read donations yet. Brian, hashtag the vape team rocks. Because they've been reading reading them before I can even open my mouth. So I just let them read them. All right. Mike and I are going to stop you. Read them. Go ahead. All right. Take it away. Uh, we know about the screen blinking black. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with that. Yep, that's YouTube. Something with YouTube going on, probably. Yep. Woo, 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 woo. Uh, got my order today. Great job on the recurve. Got a four millimeter coil in it, and it is awesome, Mike Vapes. There you go. Very good. Thank you, Chris. Where is BK? He's probably home watching the vape team. That is a good question. Where is BK at? Uh, BK was doing home remodeling, like real high-end custom woodworking. That's the last I heard mm -hmm. after his tour in Afghanistan, I guess. Yep. yep. Donation from Jay Hayes. He says, tickle, tickle. Tickle, tickle. Thank Mark's you. pickle. That was not in there. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that wasn't? No. Oh, okay. I will not hit the pot through my nose. Thank you. Oh, my God. Imagine I just you do that, Brian? With salt in it? Hit Hit a pot pot it? Yeah, of course. Don't I do it, man. Do it. It's got to burn like a son of a bitch. But that's not a pod, is it? Is there Nick salt in there? <laughs> yes, there's Nick salt in there. Wow, that had a fucking burn. I have such bad sinuses with such like scarring and stuff like that that I don't even feel it. Oh, uh, there it comes. Oh, why'd you do that, man? Probably not a good idea to do that, folks. That's got a fucking, it's got a sting. I, I hear it. I feel a nosebleed coming on very soon for Brian. Oh, God. Anyway. Oh, my God. Why look at his face. Like a Lane Bryant model. <laughs> Why do you look like a Lane Bryant model, Mark? Dude, Lane Bryant models are hot. Someone like, said you look like <laughs> I think they're pretty decent looking. Oh, I'm in a big girl, so that's actually a compliment. Thank you very much. Man, my fucking wow. That'll teach you. So Why don't I, you do another nostril? So it's I, even. 
Brian has a boogaloo on the drip tip. I don't know what that means. I don't know. I have no clue what that means. Oh, a no, boogie. You probably meant there's a boogie. Yeah. Oh. So, Mark, Mike, let me ask you a question. When you and I were sitting in Zoom all that uh, time ago. I, I need to answer Raymond's question. Now, we already knew this was going to happen tonight, Raymond. Someone bought us 400 dislikes. Thank you. Oh, so many bosses dislikes? Thank you. Appreciate that. Thank it. you for wasting your money. Yes. So anyway, go on. what were you saying? Yes. So um, when, when we were in Google Hangouts, because that's all we had back in the day, did you have any idea that things would be this way three years later? No. No clue. I didn't even expect to, my channel to be what it is. No. When did you start know. to get the feeling like this was something special and people were really like enjoying it? What's that? Talking the vape, about the I'm talking about the vape team. team. Uh, when did I think that? Oh, right away, man. Yeah. We have a donation from Ronnie Cash. He says, big girls for life. Congrats on three years, brother. So I guess he's just congr congratulating one of us, not all three of us. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Ronnie. Thank you, Ronnie. What is J wrote? I okay, Mike. I gave you money back for someone spending funds for dislikes. There you go. There you go. <laughs> I'd like to know what the fuck Jay's doing. That's what I'd like to know. Mm -hmm. He's slinging rocks. Oops, did I say that out loud? I don't know. Obviously, keeping it real makes you keeping the fucking money flowing. So, there you go. Keep it rolling in, son. Keep we, it rolling. We should use Jay Hayes's money and buy ourselves dislikes. I already did that. No, uh, thanks, Mike. You're on. Yep. Uh, Smoke Infinix versus Exceed Edge. Pros and cons. Uh, I'd watch the reviews on both. <laughs> I like the Infinix, so there's no comparison to me. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, so what about you, Brian? I, I think... I, you know what's interesting? Like, from the first show... To this very night, I have had a huge amount of anxiety every single show for 156 shows. Every week, it feels like I'm going to have a panic attack. <laughs> so if it seems like I'm on edge during the show, and I'll be fine at like 8 o'clock, and then once 9, I can feel the pressure building. And by the time it's like 10 of 10, I just can't even contain myself. I wish we, we should record like the 30 minutes before the show because it's just horrible. But um, I knew for a fact that we had great chemistry. Like, I knew that our personalities meshed. I knew that we both were, like, genuinely, like, similar type of people. And mm -hmm. um, I just had a feeling that people would connect with that. Like, we're just regular guys. We're both hardworking. And, um, you know, I just knew that it would work. We just got a okay. donation. From fuck this YT username. Brian, the drop is amazing. Mike, the recurve looks awesome. Can't wait. Till why is my screen like Mark? Can't wait. Don't worry. Can't wait till they're in my mailbox. Ready. Mark, thanks for not wasting our time with a penis RDA. I have to take my arrow key and it's got to scroll like real slowly all the way to the end of the sentence. It doesn't show the whole thing. I don't know why it doesn't. It's not like two lines. It's one long line. <laughs> he also wrote the fuck this use YouTube username. That was really hard to type. I'm so high. <laughs> That's hard to read. <laughs> well, I'm oh, going to just put this out there. Since Mark is a junior member now, that $25 just went to Mark directly. There you go. There's your bonus, Mark. So, uh, Mark, your turn. Talk. Uh, let's yeah. hear about uh, what do you think so far about uh, about the show. What yeah. were your thoughts before you came on the first time as a guest? Because like, you never met us before. You'd never been on the show before. What were your thoughts when you first saw there was a show called The Vape Team? I thought it was like a genius idea. I thought it was the coolest thing ever. Having dudes just like sitting around talking about vape shit and just hanging out. And um, I don't remember, was chat still of it? Was chat available then or no? I don't forget. How, what was up with yeah. chat? I how it worked. That was available, but you're the one that tried screwing by using it on a. But didn't they get rid of it or something? What happened? No. no? You just wanted to do it differently. Oh, I think, all right. right? Yeah. No, I could have swore they got rid of it at one point or something. No, there was always chat. Oh, okay. Yeah. No, I thought it was a genius idea. I thought it was, and then after, 
I mean, there are other vape shows, but I think after the vape team started, that's when he started seeing a lot of other shows pop up like crazy. Like I didn't, I would never think it'd be this last this long, like any vape show or any show for that matter. The fact oh. it's going three years strong is pretty amazing. Right. So that first time you came on a show as a guest after the show was over, what were your thoughts? I thought it was fun. It was like, I wanted to be a part of it permanently. Like I was excited. It was the coolest thing ever. I'm like, I want to do a live show. That's, I mean, that's where I got the idea of doing a live show. Cause I had so much fun on the vape team. I wanted to do that every single week. And that's what I'm pretty sure a lot of people also wanted to do. Like they see in the vape team and like, Oh, I got to do this. Yeah. It's, it's a lot of fun. Once you, I mean, it's fun in the beginning, but then when you start working at it and start doing like, how Brian does with the intros and outros. There's a lot of work to it, but once you get the hang of it, it's a lot of fun. Yeah, so we were technically, what, the third live show, right? Yeah. I think, third. Th well, Dimitri had a show, and he would do, like, interviews and, like, live feeds and all that kind of stuff, the Vaping Greek. It, no, he, his was the, had ended. Yeah, it had ended, but that was, like, they had done 100-something shows, I think. Okay. So and then was... the Plumes of Hazard. Right. Then the Reviewer's queue, Which that ended, too. Which that ended. So And uh, and then we started up. Yeah. Yep. So basically, it's Plumes of Hazard's the only one that's in existence that was before us. Yep. Yep. Yeah, I'm not sure if there was any other channel that did live shows back then. Oh, For anybody yeah. interested in doing a live show, I will say this, that it, it seems like it's easy and it seems like it's not work. And it's really not work per se. I mean, I'm not acting like like there was dudes in my driveway knocking down concrete, eight inches of concrete driveway they had to remove today. Like that's work. But as far as stress goes, there is some stress, but the pros outweigh the cons. Um, mm -hmm. But it is not easy doing anything 156 times. Like anybody could be great for a year. But try it for the second year and then the third year. It's sort of like marriages and relationships. You know what I mean? Like maintenance yeah. is the hardest thing for most people to deal with. If you have a passion for it, it's hard work because you want to constantly keep improving it. If yeah. you don't have a passion for it and you just click go live and just sit there with shitty audio, shitty video and give two shits, then yeah, it's easy. But a good show, usually the people on the show have a passion for the show and they always want to make it better. And that's where it gets like to be hard work. Well, and that's also why, like, when, when when this show started, I didn't want it to be, like, Brian's show. Thank you for the $10, Samish. Happy three years. Phenom funded Bendis. We love having Phenom back in us. Thank you. Yeah. Um, yeah, so when I started the show, I knew that for this to be successful long term, it had to be a, sh a channel that wasn't the Vapor Chronicles because we started on my channel. And then we, we actually created the Vape Team channel. And the reason I did that was simple. I wanted to make sure that if Mike invested his time and BK invested his time and I invested my time, then all three of us were equal partners in this and that not one of us was the vape team. The vape team was a place where we went to be together and form one unit, sort of like fucking Voltron. And and, uh, and I think that was a smart move because it, it makes it because what happens is personalities get in the way. People have egos and they want to act like they did this. They did that. This vape team is built on the personalities, the skills, and the talents of each individual. Like Mark brings something to the show that I don't. I bring something that Mike doesn't. Mike brings something, you know, and Mark brings his body fucking noises. Um, so we just got an NOK. That's uh, North Korea. Thank you, Mark. Way. It's $100 NOK. Uh, 100 NOK from Stig Robert Vormestrand. That's you definitely. Guys, what happened, Mark? Did I say good? Yep. yep. Perfect. Thank you. Thanks, Mark. Thank you, Mark. You guys are awesome. First time watching this channel, but I enjoy watching your reviews. Love from Norway. There you go. Not North Korea. Thank you, man. North Korea, Norway. I mean, there's not much of a difference. Yes. So if, if anyone's interested in watching the progression of the show, uh, you can start with <laughs> episode one. I remember I made that little intro with the vape team. Remember that, Mike? Mm-hmm. It was like the vape team, because that's where the name came from, the A-team, the vape team. Yep. And uh, and I sort of overlaid my voice, and it was like, you know, you can watch the vape team. Or the, yeah, the vape team. And I had, dun, 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 and that's how we started the show in the early days. 
And now we have this amazing 20 minute loud intro that that one guy that I still can't stop thinking about before the show started tonight. But yeah. the progression though, from the beginning to now, it's crazy. Even like with using zoom and having like all three of us on this, you know, yep. on the screen donation from Barry hot. Thank Very hot. you for entertaining us for three years. I wish you the most success with your new products. Hashtag marks helmet RDA. Thank you. It's coming soon. Mark's helmet. It's actually the drip tip and the top cap are shaped off of his uncut, uncircumcised member. Very good. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So, yeah, the progression in audio quality, like my microphone, I think I have it around here somewhere. It was like a, what, what the hell was that? A Samson or something like that? I don't know. It was so fucking tinny. And I'm like one, I like to lip smack. I'm like a lip, lip smack lack. And it was so tinny and airy, and everyone's room echoed. Mike was on his couch upstairs in the closet. I think yeah. Mark had the best setup because he had like music equipment or something. He knew like audio. Didn't, didn't yeah, you? Mark was in that same setup, had the same, not the same as now. I mean, if you look from older videos to now, you see the progression of everything. I mean, even I had that... us, I think we used to do our uh, live stream and just, I know for me, I was just using a C920 uh, webcam and using the mic off the webcam for the live, you know, doing a live. And now it's all of a sudden we have, we're doing up and close during the live shows, microphones, everything, you know? So, yep. Lots of progression through the years. Yep. It's amazing. What, what I find weird is like someone just commented in chat, made a comment how they, they don't really watch the reviews, but they watch the live shows. And there's people that actually watch the reviews and don't watch the live shows. Yeah. And then there's people that watch both. That's understandable. The people that watch the live shows uh, don't watch the reviews because they already know what they vaping. It, it, I can say they only look at YouTube. Uh, maybe if they're looking for a new product, but they enjoy. They have their products already. They're more of the hobbyists, and uh, they like watching the live show. Then you have the ones that are strictly just watching YouTube because they want for new products and they don't care about live shows. But then you have the ones that watch everything. Also, for those people that are talking about the screen going black, what's happening is is that my CPU is at ninety seven percent for some reason. I don't know if there's a virus or something, but there's something happening. It's not me clicking anything, but it's super taxed. I don't know why, but I can hear the fan running, and it, every time it goes up to about ninety six percent, I think that's when it happens. So I apologize, but there's nothing I can do about it. At least the show's on, and uh, yep. yeah. Every week before you start the show, I always tell you you should restart your computer. Thanks, Mark. Because it just like flushes the RAM out and you just start fresh. And you probably haven't restarted your computer since last week. You have never told me that. I have told you that actually a few times. Well, you need to write it down and send it to me or something. I'll put a sticky note on the screen. Yep. Why don't you just restart it right now? Okay. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> uh, yeah. So there's a lot of bulk chats out there. Who here watching the show tonight appreciates Mark on the show? I know I do. I like the bulk thing, but just doing it every week, it just honestly Not like the it's bulk, bulk. Just you in general. Oh, I, I saw someone saying bulk, bulk, bulk. I think the bulk should be just come out of nowhere. Yeah, yeah. It was funny like the first couple of times it happened, but doing it every week just like it just it's not as funny anymore. Yeah. <laughs> like I want to bulk my pants off and shit like that, but uh, you know, I think it's just gonna be one of those things that come natural. I want to do it like on a serious episode when we have someone on here like really serious at talking advocacy, and the show is like fucking just all serious, and I just rip my shirt off and it pisses yes. the guy off so bad he leaves the show. That would be fucking awesome, something like That's that, just like out of nowhere when nobody yeah. just. Somebody said. If I control out delete, I already have control out delete up. That's what I'm looking at right now. And it's the exploit program that I'm running is at 36%. The other one's at 24% for Google Chrome, which I don't know why that seems awfully high. But I wouldn't even concentrate on it. We know the screen is flashing black. Yeah. No big deal. There's enough. What are you going to do? Oh, here we go. So, uh, we, any announcements? What time? Oh, it's shit. It's 10.52. We do. We have announcements. Mark? Are you getting married? Are you pregnant? What's happening? 
I wish I could get pregnant sometimes. I want to feel that connection to a child that a woman feels. Uh, first off, uh, let's get the let's get the chat pumping. X ones, if you guys want some giveaways tonight. Yes. And also, we're doing a giveaway from last week's show. Uh, we're doing a hit that cookie line. Why did you block Amy from the chat? So I wrote? didn't block Amy from the chat. I did not block Amy from the chat. I wish I Yeah, I don't think Amy's blocked. Yeah, I don't know. Pop, 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 pump it up. I'll tell you what, though. If Amy is blocked and I didn't do it, I'm blocking everybody that has uh, privileges, and they're all being blocked. There you go. So, besides you, Mark, and me, everyone else is going to be pulled. <laughs> so. So. We're Mark? doing a giveaway we're doing from a giveaway. last week's show. Are right, we doing last week first? Yeah. Yes, last week's show, we're going to announce the giveaway winner. It's for the Hit That Cookie line, and it's only for a U.S. resident. So the winner, if you hear your name announced from last week's show, just confirm in the chat that you are a U.S. resident. Or uh, if you're not watching this week and you watch the replay, email me or find me on Facebook, Mike Vapes on Facebook. There you go, Mark. All right. Pick a winner. winner from last week is going to be. Gotta make the sound effect. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I love that. They didn't have to say anything, right? Nope. Okay. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, they, they did. There, there's something they had to say. All right. Well, this this person said, "Great show, y'all." That was a total surprise, Mark. Out of the blue. Awesome. I'm gonna fuck this name up big time. No, uh, that's not that's not the winner. Oh, right. all right. Well, what, what did they have to say last week? Hold up, just they just say name. I want to hit something's cookie or something. Yeah. Did they? Oh, did they? Okay. Something like that. Yeah. Well, you have all the comments pulled up, so you Mark, can't. Are you paying these. attention? Look at I'm the paying. comments. No, I don't. Oh, I do have the comments pulled up. Let me go. <laughs> no, I could have swore there was not there was nothing they had to say last week. I, I told, can't he's going to get demoted already. Mike, I, I told Mark that when he's waiting for a CPAP, we should get him a leaf blower and he could duct tape it to his lips All at right. night. <laughs> they they have to say, I want to hit that cookie. So here we go. Let's do this again. Do, 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 do. Richard Ortz. O R T I Z. Ortz. Ortiz, man. It's Ortiz, Orts. dude. It's not Ortiz, it's Ortz. O R T I Z? Yeah. It's Ortiz. I don't think it's Ortiz. I is there a fucking T I Z at the end? Yes, O R T I Z. How is it? What is that? Ortiz? It's Orts. 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 Okay, so you've been know. on this show. You've fucked up so many names. You actually went to school, so you know what you're capable of. <laughs> Who do you think is right in this situation? Ortiz would be O R T double E Z or E A Z. Oh my God. <laughs> Jesus. Stop, Mark. <laughs> I, I think serious? he's right. I think he's right, actually. No. All right. <laughs> right. He's Congratulations, Richard Ortz. Okay, Richard Ortiz, congratulations. You have won. Send me a message on uh, Facebook or email me. All righty, then. Thank you. Thank so you, we have, Richard Ortiz. Uh, we have more giveaways tonight. The next one is also going to be to Mike. <laughs> This, this giveaway is actually going to be inspired by Orts. And uh, this is you also want to contact Mike, the same as with the last giveaway. This is going to be for the Inokin Proton Kit with the Scion 2. So this is going to be a chat giveaway. It's a chat giveaway for tonight. Our way of saying thank you. Inokin, first of all, let me, let me just stop and say thank you to Inokin, thank you to Aspire, and thank you to Geek Vape. Because the three of those are our sponsors and they're fucking awesome. And we thank you for their support. We thank you for them supporting the giveaways tonight. And uh, we also thank you for you know supporting the show. Because without them, the show would not be possible. Thank you. Hell yeah. Mark, uh, do you even know who our sponsors are? Inakin, Geek Vape, and... Quartz. Uh, Spire? Yes, sir. Pick a winner. Winner is... Pick a number. 72. Oh, yeah. 72, here we go. 72 is Don 
Earls, E A R L S, Earls. Congratulations, Don Earls. Don Earls. And that's that's pronounced correctly. Thank you. Yes, Mr. Don Earls. Congratulations, brother. Don Earls, spelled W H I T E. Don, you know how to mess. You know how to find me, Mr. Don. There you go. So congratulations. You're going to get the Anakin Proton. Mm hmm The kit. Awesome. Mm hmm That's right. That's right, baby girl. Mm hmm mm hmm All right. So the next giveaway is going to be three things. It's going to be one winner. You're going to win three things. You're basically going to have everything covered for everything you need. You're going to get the Aegis, the Geek Vape Aegis Legend kit. So you're going to get the Aegis Legend, which is the dual 18650 underwater, you know, Ambitions Vapor swimming in a fucking public pool with his mod, mod, which I thought was the coolest video ever. And uh, you're also going to get the uh, aero tank that comes with it, which I think is an awesome tank with the uh, mesh coil. You're also going to get a Zeus duel, so you're going to get your RTA action going on. And you're going to get the U-Pen, which is the beautiful device I was showcasing earlier. You're not getting this one, though, I promise you that. You're going to get your own one. So there you go. So Mark, this is the Grand Pooba. Now, for this giveaway, before Mark picks it, because I know he gets a little antsy and he wants to go into action, he's also overheating, uh, you need to contact me on The Vapor Chronicles on Facebook Messenger. And what, what I need from you is I need your name, I need your address, I need your email address, and I need your telephone number, and a picture of a photo ID. That's all you need to send me. Name, address, telephone number, email address, photo ID, and you need to be anywhere in the world. You better have some identity theft protection because you're going to need it. All right. Ready? <laughs> go ahead. Here we go. Can I get a number, please? P pick the winner, Mark John Un. I need a number before I can pick a winner. 42. 42. Hold on, don't pack it. Don't no say winner. it. We just got a donation for a dollar ninety nine. Who is that? Do we know? Vaping Miner. Thank you, Vaping Miner. X one dollar ninety nine. Vaping Miner? Yeah. As in like underage or as in like coal miner? I think it's coal, coal miner. miner. Coal miner. All right, here we go. Forty two. No winner. Let's do it again. Forty two. Oh, Jim, capital V, little V. Jim, capital V, little V. There we go. Congratulations, Jim, VV. V as in China. Thank you. There you go. V as in China. I can see Mark doing exotic dances with that fan. What the hell? I got it from the chick at uh, Geek Vape. He got it from the chicken as massage parlor. Oh, you have nice penis for big fat man. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. All right, guys. Well, that is it. That is the show. That is. Yes. Oh wait, 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 wait. Yeah. We're doing another giveaway. Really? We're doing a replay giveaway. Replay. Replay. So after this show ends, when it gets re-uploaded on YouTube, in the comments down below, not the chat, comments down below, uh, make sure to comment. If you guys, uh, this is a U.S. only giveaway. It's for Hit That Donut. There you go. The three, the three newest Hit That Donut line. Yes. Hit That Donut. Hit That Donut. Uh, that would be strawberry donut? donut, which is delicious, chocolate donut, which is delicious, and my favorite, Boston Cream. There so basically, go. if you want to be entered in the giveaway and you live here in the United States, your comment should have inside the comment, I want to hit that donut. There you go. I want to hit that donut. And if you want to hit that donut and you don't want to wait two weeks for us to pick a winner, what you can do is head to hitthatjuice.com and pick, your up, pick yourself up some right now. Thank you don't you. even have to wait. You could be hitting that donut in like, what, two days, Mike, if they live in the U.S.? Three days? Oh, yeah, two, three days. Yep. And nothing tastes better on the recurve than some hit that donut, I'm just saying. So yeah, it's been a real pleasure, Mike. I thank you for everything you bring to the show, man. I think you're a fucking amazing person, and uh, the show wouldn't be the same without you. Yeah, Mark. I, about that. I think you are awesome. 
I, I think that we're all perfectly matched for an awesome show. I agree. Totally. Yep. And, and let me tell you something, Mike, as much as he seems like he's the serious one, you get a little cran vodka in him. He gives a hell of a back massage. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm saying. Yep. Ooh, dress like a lady. Also, if anybody's going to be in Birmingham in the UK next weekend at Vape U- is it Vape UK? What's the name of the uh, Expo Vape Expo Vape Expo UK. UK or something like that in Birmingham? Uh, Mike's going to be there. I'm going to be there. I know Heathen's going to be there. Bogan's going to be there. Uh, who else is going to be there? Tenacious TX is going to be there. Tenacious TX is going to be there. Uh, who else? Uh, Sandre from Geek Vape is going to be there. <laughs> yeah, Sandra. She does uh, actually uh, really awesome massages too. Plus, uh, UK. A lot of the UK reviewers. A lot of the UK there. reviewers are going to be there. Well, I can't wait to meet all those beautiful people. So I think Mike's going to be at the Watofo booth. Yep, I'll be gonna, Watofo and Signature Tips going back and forth. I'm going to be hanging with my boys at Signature Tips the whole time, and I'll be walking around meeting people and stuff and enjoying. So it should be awesome. Joe Tur- Joe motherfucking Turner's gonna be there. Hell yeah, Joe Turner. Donation from uh, Big D Rob Nasty. Congrats, guys. Give us another three years. Why does it seem like it was a comment that was? Oh, I don't know. And also a donation from Brian Smells. No Thank comment you. on that one, but Brian Smells. That is actually kind of true. But yes, congrats. Thank you. I smell like cheap box wine and patchouli. There you go. Yep. <laughs> I used to bang girls in high school that smelled like cheap box wine and patchouli. Oh, here we go. Just saying. I used to bang girls that used to smell like fucking fish. I bet you did. I bet you did. Mm-hmm. When you're hitting them in the shit box behind the fucking Bob's Big Boy mark, what do you expect? You know what I mean? You gotta stick your thumb right in the hole in the butthole and to cover it up. How about you, you just to- tell them how to wipe? Uh, that's actually not a bad idea. Yeah, so this, by the way, we want to thank you guys because this show would not be possible without everybody that shows up and chats every week and joins us. It just, thank you. Uh, question from Kim Mike Vapes, your sound signs, sounds, your sound sounds like it always did. Did you not like the? <laughs> I concur with that question. Thank you. I do concur. Sorry, Kim. I have no clue what you're talking about, but thank you for watching. <laughs> Dracar and Dumpster. There you I'm go. I she's talking about my uh, when I'm doing the live show on my channel. Hmm. I, saw, I fixed that issue. Maybe that's what it is. Hmm. Anyway, thank you, everyone. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for all the support. Yep. Yes. And in two weeks from now, we're going to be starting at 9 o'clock p.m. instead of 10 p.m. Yep, 9 p.m. Two weeks. We're going to be an hour earlier. Hour earlier. For those that are confused with uh, time, well, an hour earlier. Yeah, maybe. Mark, are you going to be able to deal with that after your after dinner nap? I'm going to love it because it's like a, it's eight o'clock for me, which means I can come in the room at like seven or six thirty, which means that's going to be perfect. We'll see how that goes. I'm a little bit skeptical. Oh, by that time, I won't be taking naps anymore because I have my CPAP machine. So we should have a CPAP show where we lay here and just put our CPAPs on and vape and talk. That's a great idea. Maybe get Mike one too, and we'll all just CPAP it up. Yep. This might be hard though for me at 9 p.m. Why? I'll talk about it later. I mean, if you want to change it back, we can do it right now because everyone's still watching. What up, Sugar Johnson? That sounds oh, like a well, porn star. We'll see. We'll see. All right. That's it. Well, that's it, okay. guys. Three years of our lives. That's a lot of time. And we've loved every second of it. We really appreciate all the support. Like once again, the black screens happened once again. So we're going to end the show. We're going to fade black permanently this time. Mm-hmm. Hopefully the CPU problem is going to be fixed. I'm going to look into it after the show tonight. But uh, yeah, the vape team, 156, three years done. Yes. We love you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Say bye, Mark, with your real voice. Bye, Mark, with your real voice. Say Mark. Say bye with your Tranny voice. Bye, motherfuckers. Bye. Bye.
Fix all these guys. Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. Twenty minute outro. Twenty minute outro. Call Mark Fagan. There we go. Mark Fagan, call Alexa. Alexa, call Alexa. Holy oh, shit, my thing is like going haywire. Alexa, call Alexa. What to do? I'm fucking lost. Holy shit. What happened? <laughs> Miles Hintz said to Brian, $10 Canadian. Thank you, sir. Rich Thank you for the donations. By the way, everyone that donated tonight, Jay Hayes, everyone else, I just see Jay Hayes up there because he donated the most and his stays up the whole time. Thank you. And uh, good evening, Greg. Good evening. What the fuck? Oh, by the way, Richard Ortiz said that uh, Mike and Brian said his name right. There we go. Well, who didn't fucking know that? <laughs> See you guys in two weeks. Bye.